Hello everyone, welcome back to another reaction video, and today I'll be doing a reaction to Teapot Episode 3, The Power of Two. Getting pop ball to think about roller coasters. Hmm, don't think bad things. Hmm. I wonder what will happen in this one. I guess is Well, I guess it would be best to not think at all. <laughs> so, I think we should get into it right now. Let's go. And I think you sh all should Go subscribe to Dragon Jovi. Discover satisfaction. <laughs> what is going on today? Today? Oh, well. What a great day. Did you notice any of these blocks <laughs> there? <laughs> well, now that you mention it. Hey, you're right. These blocks are out of control and we need to stop. <laughs> Twist you into a pretzel. Get rid of these blocks now. I'm just trying to spruce the place up. Adding my flair, but not causing any problems. Uh, oh, Philly. Everyone, quick, get out of here. I'll take care of these. You guys get out of here. Hey, preventing death is our job. Everyone, save yourselves. Ah! No. Oh, yeah. oh, oh. Oh. Yucky barf. Makes me want to vomit. Thanks for doing it for me, Rocky. Oh, uh, yuck. Uh, sorry. Uh, here's a new Zabray TD. Please be more careful with this one. Ooh, a Zabray. No, not my cheesecake. Not my cheesecake. <laughs> death. Maybe we'll forfeit this challenge on purpose and just focus on preventing death this round. We need to put a stop to all of this death. Agreed. It's time for cake and steak. <laughs> Today's cake is cheesecake. It has been ruined a bit by the situation. I'm sure it's delicious too. It has shards of glass all over it, but are you saying you'd still eat it? Um, gosh, if I'm safe, then I'll try. Then let's get to it. Last time, the strongest team on Earth lost by building a zero block tower. Whichever of their members got the fewest votes from you viewers is eliminated. Out of 74,873 votes, Grassy is the first contestant safe with 26,669 votes. I'm Grassy. And I'm too. Are you going to eat your cake, Grassy? Oh, gosh! Next safe is Snowball with 13,017 votes. Will you eat... No. How about you, Belle, with 10,617 votes? I'll save it for later. I'd eat it up, too. Good news for you, because you're safe with 6,847 votes. Basketball, you're safe next, mate, with 6,150 votes. Thanks! Um, nom, 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 nom. I'm glad you loved it. <gasps> It's down to two of you, Foldy and Eggy. Which of you will be safe? Well, I promised to eat the cake, so hopefully I'm joining Pie. Joining Pie eating a cake, maybe? Because I might send her some extra. Because you're safe, Eggy, with 5,977 votes. Foldy is out with 5,596 votes. Oh my origami book that's called Geogami. I've been eliminated? It's been fun, guys. And with that, we're back down to 41 contestants. Uh... What? I mean, it may have not been like how Ford does it, but, um... Where'd they go? Um... Foldy! Hey, two. A lot of us have been wondering, if there's 41 contestants, and we compete this infrequently, how are we gonna ever possibly finish this competition? Huh? Seriously? Where do you keep leaving for months on end? Oh, gosh, fine! I'll show you all my greatest shame. Welcome everyone to my amusement park. My amusement uh, park? I'll figure it out. I like it. Remote, there's nothing here. I know, I like minimalism. I've been trying to make a profit for the last two years, but not a single ticket has been sold. Do you think maybe it has something to do with the fact that no one knew it existed, there's no rights or any entertainment, and we all hate it? <laughs> 
<gasps> You're right, Fanny. About us all hating it? No, about there being nothing here. I believe you all had an issue with these blocks, saying there were too many. Why don't we solve both problems at once? Let's declutter our lives of all these blocks by putting them into an amusement park. Folks, today's challenge is to use the leftover blocks I've been stacking around the grasslands and use them to make some sort of amusement park attraction for the park. By sunset, I'll assess all your attractions on a scale of 1 to 10, and the losing team will be up for elimination. Well, this definitely solves that cumbersome block situation, which has caused nothing but death and mayhem. Darn it, you've convinced me. We should keep the blocks. Grr! There's the blocks, and here's some supplies. Go! <laughs> sound of that sounds rife with death related possibilities then let's follow them and absolve ourselves from our earlier mistakes go 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 are you a boring person being boring why not be entertaining for once yellow face enough ads i was talking to you oh uh but hey yellow face i actually like the idea Guys, maybe we should make some sort of performance stage for the park. Sounds good to me. <laughs> and maybe this could be our chance to see winner perform without loser live. Well, we don't have to push that. We do right. have yellow face. <laughs> hmm, well, maybe... Yellow face, while we construct a stage out of blocks, why don't you rehearse a performance or two? Can do. I've got just the idea for a script. <laughs> what? Nothing. This is just so good so far. Tell me, Icy, are you okay with being shattered repeatedly for the performance? No. I know. Guys, I know. Oh, you go. Last round was a wake-up call, guys. We need to work better as a team. I agree. We should try unscrambling the mess that happened last time. Really? What? You're gonna use that word around me? Oh, sorry, Eggy. Enough talking about yummy foods. The answer our team needs has been hiding right in front of us. Or should I say above us? Okay, actually, it's below us. What? Now it's to the right of us? Who the heck is controlling this thing? No, it's going next to my molecular structures. This is going too far. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the one who controls it is the animators. But what does it actually say? Things smaller than a molecule. It says the strongest team on Earth. What do you mean that our team's answer has been hiding there? Well, what's the first thing truly strong people look for at an amusement park? A restaurant? A purpose? Or a food? No, think strength, guys. We're gonna build a contraption for two to test their limitless power and put these weaklings to shame. Simple. I like it. Hmm. I guess we could add one of those one of those things that takes a string. Well, you well, you know, there's a those punching bags, you punch it, and it moves your strings. That, that would be nice. So, and some of the people kick it. That can work. Speaking of simple, what is Teardrop making? Just a table with blocks on it? Looks like she's already struggling by herself. Good for our team, though, I guess. Guys, did you hear that idea from Eggy? A restaurant? That sounds amazing. Let's do that. Ooh, I can't wait to see all the things we can create and put on a plate for two to rate. That was another team's idea. That they're not using. It still feels like cheating again. I don't want this to be a pattern, guys. I understand, Pin, but they're not actually doing the restaurant. Why leave such a good idea on the table? <laughs> Just like the table we put in our restaurant. Fine. I suppose we can serve an apple or something. I'll go get blocks for the building. <sighs> I'm salivating already. Introducing my newest invention to you all. The brainwave. Simply keep an idea of something in your mind. And the machine will bring it into reality. Here, just stare at this drawing of a simple roller coaster, Puffball. Keep it simple. In a few hours, your brain will finish uploading the idea into the machine. And we can release it into the park. Don't think very bad things. Do not or it'll ruin the roller coaster. Simply ruin it. But we need to incorporate the blocks, golf ball. Way ahead of you. The seats that the riders will sit in will be manufactured out of blocks. Four seats in total should do. TV, play a tutorial for us, will you? Okay. Bored. There's too many of us and not enough to do. Then why don't you go make yourself useful and go hinder some other teams like last time? And I know just who to. 
Do, 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 do. Oh, what are you guys doing down here? We're here to cause some inner team shenanigans. Oh, hey, that's what I'm doing too. You guys are cool. Later. I always knew I was cool. I always knew you were cool too. But guys, they're just building a roller coaster. I hate roller coasters. What if you fall off? You die? You're right. Let's create a landing pad for the people that prefer not to do that. This heat might come in handy. Let's get out of here, gang. We're falling behind, and we still don't have an idea. How about we short book for our attraction? Ooh, I love creating anagrams. How about a pile of... Oh, I love it, Cake! What does that mean? Oh, I think I follow. It's always fun to pick up some silly prizes and things at an amusement park. Thank you. I struggled to put it into words. No worries. That idea is... A million bucks? That works quite well. Good idea, Cake. Okay, folks. Let's head to the hotel and find some cool gadgets that might make for some cool prizes. You okay, Pin? Huh? Yes. Just second-guessing our team strategy. Second-guess later! We need to build this place! We're gonna need some tables and chairs. Then let's get carving! Wait! Why are we using me? I saw an opportunity! Uh-huh. <laughs> I admire your tutorial abilities! These chairs are looking phenomenal! You could have just shown us how to make lame and boring basic chairs! But you went above and beyond. Everyone, let's chant TV's name together. TV, TV, TV. Above and beyond. And here I am making a basic whatever roller coaster. I'm just gonna say it, TV. You'll go down as a legend forever for this. Because you went above and beyond and didn't do the basic thing. That would have been mediocre. Not basic, huh? Maybe I could spruce up the ideas for the roller coaster. Drop offs, sudden cliffs, loops. Balls, dangerous, deadly, the most exciting ride ever, and they will all love me. Uh, it. They'll love it. <laughs> Ooh, teardrop. Ooh, what's this? Sure would be a shame if I zapped your attraction away, huh? Ugh, you don't even care. Maybe your attraction is so puny that it doesn't even matter if I break it. Hey, uh. Looks like my work is already done. <laughs> There's random things behind the desk here. Wowzer, but wowzer. Ideally, it'd be something like Dream Island. A thousand batteries, a jawbreaker, some garbage. Don't call it that. That's amazing. Nickel, Bommy just told you that some of it is literal garbage. Value is in the eye of the beholder, Nelly. Do you truly believe that, or are you saying it because you're a nickel? A bit of both. Okay, guys, if we make two stacks, maybe four blocks high and this sheet over it, we may be able to save a high fall from the roller coaster. I've got this. Hmm. Bouncy. Whee! Stop playing on that. You're acting like it's some sort of amusement park attraction or something. Yeah, this is strictly for death prevention. Oh, right. This place looks great! Hopefully two likes eating here. <gasps> the food! Pin, did you get that apple you mentioned? It slipped my mind. No, we forgot our dish. Or did we? Uh, we did, but this works. Yellow face, how's the performance? So good. Check out this opening dance I have for it. You're a brilliant dancer, too? Is there anything you can't do? Well, sometimes I worry that. Yellow face has got this clock all under control. Hmm. Clock? Yeah, the performance is gonna be great. Don't push anyone, Clock. Ah! Oops. Sorry, what? Cloudy, how's the stage going, buddy? You tell me. It reminds me of sorting a collection. Just kind of fits into place, really. You guys like it? Have you ever needed a brilliant stage? Then contact Cloudy. Oh, thanks, guys. This is sturdy. We will win this. So... What? Are we just seeing if two can knock over the stack? Yeah! If they can prove themselves, they can knock it over! I feel like it's not quite ready. Grr! What? Not ready? No one likes my idea! Arr! No, that's not... Hey, there's an idea! What? We'll just keep clobbering, Belle? Nope, I'll need some string. There's some in my lab at the hotel, I'm pretty sure. I'll glue the rest of the stack together. I'm on string duty! Be back in a flash! 
Oh, hello, Robot Flower. Oh, goodbye, Robot Flower. Everyone, the sun is setting, so I recommend you all meet me back at the amusement park. Judging of your attractions will begin shortly. And that's the last of the tears. Thank you for visualizing our roller coaster, Puffball. Time to check the preview ends. Impressed? No! Puffball, that is so dangerous. It is absolutely outrageously ridiculous. But... What? We don't have time to restart. You have simply ruined our idea. Uh, we don't even have time to make another. Uh, no need to dwell on it. Let's take the invention thingy and upload the coaster into the park already. We can't just take garbage, can we? Garbage and a jawbreaker and a battery or two. Brilliant. Well, didn't you all hear two's announcement? Better something than nothing. We gotta go. <gasps> Got it! Grab the garbage, folks, and then grab Robot Flower. Why don't you say to grab the same thing twice? <laughs> Got the string! Perfect! You're a lifesaver. <laughs> Here we go. Done! There, now it's a punching game. A real test of strength. Yes! Oh, I love it! I love it so much! I just want to hit something! <gasps> Why did you hit our teammate? Just use our punching game next time. Oh, right. Okay, golf ball. Now we've got your brainwave thing. Now what do we do? Just click upload, and it'll spawn before our eyes. Let's just get our block seats onto the right immediately. A dangerous attraction is better than nothing. That thing looks so dangerous. We might have made the right call, just preventing death this time, team. I knew it! Everyone, look at the sun! It is nearly set! Really? To me, it looks like it'll still take about an hour or so. I'll never doubt you again. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> okay, that was close. But now, I'll never out you again. Thank you. Are you okay? What attraction have you created? We've made a roller coaster for your park. The blocks are the chairs you'll be seated in during your ride. Hey, too. You should ride on that. Oh, good idea, Pillow. It'll be dangerous and they'll lose for sure. They'll also die. I love the idea, Pillow. I love rides. Are you okay? Please join me on the ride. Puffball, can you push the lever to begin our trip? Uh, okay. Wow, this is lovely so far. Someone save our souls! Oh, I'm saved. Wow, this is quite fun. Bounce, bounce. Ten out of ten. Wow, really? The Death Pact again. For making an amazing trampoline. I've always loved these. As for the Are You OK Death Trap, it was exhilarating, but might need to be closed for future renovations for future guests. So let's just give it a five out of ten, shall we? We all take it. Thank you, too. Strongest team on Earth. What is this? Hey, too. I reckon you're so weak. <gasps> what? No, I'm not so weak. Oh, yeah? Well, can you take on this feat of strength? I have ugh, such trouble moving it, but I don't even know if you're up to the challenge, too. Wow, it looks hard. Let me try. <laughs> Whew, a strong game for a strong team. Simple, and I like it. That's what I said. Fast is back. And now there's a whole new test to try. I don't know how I feel about this new element, but I love what I played. 7 out of 10. Three strong attractions so far. The S, it's time for your attraction. We've created a stage out of blogs for a performance area. Hmm. Well, if it's for a performance area, I'm going to need to see a performance. Luckily for you, we have Yellowface. Winner! Oh, but I've been rehearsing. I know Yellowface, but who could miss a chance to see Winner perform live? Come on, this will actually make us win. Huh? Think about it. This is your chance to re-enter the mainstream. I don't think I'm ready for that. Trust me, you got this. Two, presenting Winner's solo show. Show back to the mainstream. Yay! Woohoo! And there's no one on stage. Bomber. Huh? Winner, where are you going? I didn't agree to this at all, Clark. Don't push me to do something like this when I'm not ready. I wasn't trying to force you, I just. I think I'd rather be by myself for now. Oh. Well, no performance ended up taking place, and you've just constructed an empty stage. Nothing really to do here. Sorry, guys, but that's a zero out of ten. No! 
Let's see what you've been working on, Teardrop. Huh? What do you want me to do with this? Who cares? Give me that. Oh, how fun! And you did this all by yourself, Teardrop? What a fun carnival game! I'm gonna give that a 5 out of 10. You were meant to hurt her, Jesus, not help her! Good zapped, TD! Good run forever! What is this? Garbage? Yeah. Uh, it's garbage! On a table! Okay. Think of it like a bunch of prizes! You have all these rides and activities, too, but is it really an amusement park if there's no prizes? But a jawbreaker? Batteries? These have almost no value! So what's the value you want, <laughs> $30? That makes the value clear. You guys get a 3 out of 10. Sound fair? Yes! We did it! Good job, price tag. Oh my heavens! Oh, Northern Death! We'll consider that mark a save for death prevention. So that leaves us with just teammates left. As long as you lock it above a zero, then you'll beat the S. I'm sure you'll enjoy what we put together, too. Of course, Katie. Everything you put your mind to is always fantastic. Ow. So we put together... Ow! Face! I've got you now, TD! Go! Hey, Mr. Wright! Hey, sir! Teardrop! No! Well, since you have nothing to show me, this also gets a zero out of ten. Sad with a capital S. Two teams got a zero, so what'll the tiebreaker be, too? Hopefully not a performance! <laughs> Sorry, Yellowface. I promise to do better going clockwise. Well, it hardly seems fair to the other teams to give you both another shot. And earlier, Clock, you did point out this game is going so slowly. If there's 41 contestants, and we compete this infrequently, how are we gonna ever possibly finish this competition? So, we're just gonna have both? Offer elimination? So, I think a way to speed up this competition is to have two teams up for elimination! <gasps> oh, I get it! Cause you're two! Viewers, two teams are up for elimination, but you only get one vote total, so vote one contestant you want to have saved. The contestant with the fewest votes on teammates and the contestant with the fewest votes on the S will both be eliminated. Make your one vote count! Hello, this is Michael. Okay, toot! The both teams are for elimination, but I can only vote for one. One of the two Huang twins that created BFDI, and I just want to say thank you so much for watching T53. Thank you for waiting, even during this time when we haven't been uploading as often. I want to say thank you to the whole crew that made this possible. Thank you to Sam. Thank you to our animators, audio editors, and also for you voters. Know that future episodes are going to come out a little bit more regularly. Also, in case you wanted to know, this is the room where I record voices. This is what it looks like. In case you even didn't want to know. Now you know. I'll see you in Tifa 4. See ya! Introducing the amazing Eggy and Bell to the stage! Woohoo! We must now eat two's glassy top cake! Glassy! Ugh, somebody please help. Did somebody say marker? No, I'm here to prevent that. Don't eat that cake as you'll die. But then, what do we do? We told Two we'd eat it. I'll do it for you. It's almost like eating sand. Which is also glass, but very microscopic. I agree with the look of horror in everyone's eyes. And this will be used as my thumbnail for this video. Okay, got the screenshot. So yeah, hope you guys like and subscribe. I, I'll finish this up real quick, give it on and it's just gonna be done. Yeah. So yeah. Okay, so, both two teams are for elimination, and it can you and we can only vote for one person. So we can only vote for one person of the team. You, you cannot vote for two people on, the, on different teams. You cannot vote for two people. Only vote for one. So yeah, if you want to comment for someone to be to be safe. Just type the letter bracket of the person you want to keep in the show on the comment of, of the T-Bot 3. So yeah, comment below on who you want to keep in. Uh, on T-Bot 3, or else it's not going to count. Because you, do not comment on my video, comment on the, the actual video of the episode. 
But yeah, who do you think I should save? Comment down, um, down below. And if you want to go do it, go comment on Teapot 3. But anyway, hope, hope you guys like and subscribe. Subscribe to me. Subscribe to Dragon Jellyfy for future episodes of BFDI or, or, and or Teapot. Subscribe to my friend's channel. Subscribe to my YouTube friend's channel. Subscribe to my other accounts. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.